Jesse. I'm a second year MPA student here at COP this week looking at issues of private finance, adaptation, and urbanization in Sub-Saharan Africa. And I'm Claire. I'm also a second year MPA. I'm looking at climate tech and migration issues. We are really excited to take you along with us at the world's largest climate conference. Here we go. Climate! Climate! Women continue to have unequal access to education, to financing. and have been unsustainably overexploiting natural resources. I've been trying to follow a thread here at COP which focuses on the connection between the Crowsphere um, and uh, the Global South and indigenous communities. We're here at the UN Climate Change Conference where we finally have some draft text for the major cover decisions. There's still substantial disagreement between countries. Rather weak language on fossil fuel phase out. These green and these green lines and, and colorful lines here represent all. It's Thursday, another big day at COP. Today is Solutions Day, so I've spent the morning at the Africa Pavilion listening to plans for scaling resilient infrastructure. And I've been hanging out at the Innovation Hub, um, looking at projects in tech transfer, mainly for adaptation in developing countries. Hoping to see the new president elect of Brazil, Luiz da Silva. What else? Do you need? Um, I don't know. I'm going to see where the wind's taking. <laughs> As a young person that has the energy, the intellect, and the creativity, have decided to form an organization. definitely recommend attending for anyone who's interested in, in equity and in climate sustainability or the widespread of climate careers that are out there, both in the public and private sector. It's been another long day here at COP. Um, I saw Secretary Kerry, which was really cool. We're pretty tired, but we're going to go to a couple more events, uh, maybe sit in on some negotiations, and then call it a night. Hope you enjoyed this tour with us. Uh, we'll see you all back at Princeton soon. Woo! Bye,